there's always been this spirit, the scientific spirit, the willingness to explore, to reveal things that we can't see with the naked eye. There have always been attempts by humanity to understand life. The microscope is one of those fundamental tools which has changed and revolutionized society. In 1919, it was clear that microscope technology was the future of science. 当時、顕微鏡といえば、まあ、海外製品が主流だったんですけれども、非常に高価で、なかなか日本のドクターや研究をされる方が買うには難しかったと。そこで山下武氏は、国産で量産することによって、手頃で、かつ高品質な顕微鏡を日本にも提供しようということを、まあ、志にして創業したというふうに理解しています。一番最初に取り組んだ製品は、朝日号という顕微鏡です。The Asahi Go was just a very clean line. It had a single position for one objective. It's a beautiful instrument even today. This was really the beginning of things for Olympus. As science has advanced, so have the demands of scientists. The microscope tools needed to become more sensitive, more automated. A lot of the current optical technologies that we work on allow for live cell imaging to track and, and view cells over time without harming them. These are the tools that help advance science and medicine. Now, we are a scientist in the medical field, and there are three types of tools. One is to see the patient's 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 patient. もう一つは基礎研究の用途で病気がどうやって発生していくのかどうやって薬で治していこうとするのかっていう研究エリアでの顕微鏡の使い方三つ目は工業用途で例えば鉄とかですねアルミニウムとか金属の組織がどうなっているのかっていうのを拡大してみる特にクオリティアシュアランスで使われます。The regular consumer may not have any idea about the technology that's actually part of their everyday life. The industrial products are widely used as a way to prevent failure. We put a sensor on a material and we use ultrasound or eddy current to learn and get intelligent information. Let's say it's an aircraft. Our products are first used to make sure that all the dimensions are exactly to specification. You can look for defects, you can look for cracks, surface problems. When parts are bonded together, they're used to make sure that the bond lines are tight. Because if they're not, when that aircraft eventually goes into the air, things will loosen up. Then failure happens and disaster happens. Olympus has a very strong responsibility. We take the quality of what we're making very seriously. This equipment allows us to look inside the engine without us having to actually take it apart. It's like when you go to a doctor and get an x-ray. Doing a borescope inspection allows us to look for defects, cracks, corrosion at night so the plane can fly in the morning safe and make its destination. Our number one value here is safety. We all fly on these aircraft all the time. My family flies on them. This is a way we can ensure our passengers that the engine is going to be safe for their flight. That's our number one goal and the most important thing we do. It's a good feeling. It's something to be proud of. We are always looking to contribute in the most meaningful way possible. We are looking at things like precision medicine. Most people know somebody in their life who's had cancer. Through our imaging technology, we can examine the patient's tumor to understand whether or not a particular anti-cancer compound will work for a specific patient. Recently, it all became very, very real and very personal for me. Um, my wife got sick. 
uh, she got cancer and um, uh, I'd been working on precision medicine. It was always meaningful to me intrinsically, but now it could potentially impact the person I love most. There's so much technology that's going into keeping you safe. We should never take it for granted. When I became a mom, and I'm looking at all the car seats on the, on the shelf, and I saw the company that I knew that used our products, I bought that one. People change the world with the tools that we create. There's a mission that we are on at Olympus to create healthier and safer environments.